Welcome everyone to story time today. This looks like a cooking show, doesn't it? I'm wearing an apron. I'm wearing a special hat. This is a chef hat. A chef is someone who cooks. And we are going to be making some soup today. But we are not making regular soup. We're making pretend soup. But we're also not even making regular pretend soup. We are going to make story soup today. I'm going to put up our letters for story soup. We have the letter S, T, O, R, Y, story, S, O, U, P, soup. We are making story soup. Are you ready? Story soup? How do we make story soup? Well, one important thing that I need you to help me do is to sing the story soup song. It goes like this. We're making story soup. We're making story soup. Stir slow around we go. We're making story soup. And I can stir it. I have a long wooden spoon. I also have a ladle. This is called a ladle and I'll use those to stir this soup. Now, if we were making pretend vegetable soup, what would we need to put in it? Vegetables. Yes, I agree. I have a basket of vegetables here. We have some vegetables like green peppers, and we have, oh, we have some onions. We have some corn. We have some red peppers. And so we're going to sing about adding the vegetables. All right, and when I get to that point, I'll tell you what we're going to add next and we'll sing all together. All right, so let's first sing that song that we just learned about stirring slow. All right, I just have some pretend water in here. Here we go. We're making story soup. We're making story soup. Stir slow around we go, we're making story soup. First we add some corn. First we add some corn. Stir slow around we go, we're making story soup. Next we add red pepper. Then we add green pepper. Stir slow around we go, we're making story soup. Well, this soup is starting to smell pretty good. Can you smell it? For pretend. Well, I think we probably should add a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. This is a pepper mill. Pepper for pretend. All right, so we'll sing. First we added salt, then we added pepper. First we added salt, then we added pepper. Stir slow around we go, we're making story soup. All right, well it's getting nice and warm on our pretend fire here. So I wonder, I should maybe add an oven mitt so I can hold the edge of my pot. Well, since this is a pretty good vegetable soup, to make it into story soup, what do you think we'll need to add? Any ideas? I think maybe some letters. We need letters to make stories, don't we? So how about if we sing, um, next we'll add some letters. Well, next we'll add some letters, like the letter C. Next we'll add some letters, Stir slow around we go, we're making story soup. What else should we put in? 
Maybe, maybe some paper. That's a good idea. How about if we say, next we add some paper. Next we add some paper. Stir slow around we go. We're making story soup. Sometimes I especially, especially love to have pictures in my stories. Let's add some pictures next, okay? Here we go. Next we'll add some pictures. Next we'll add some pictures. Stir slow around we go. We're making story soup. Well, this soup is looking pretty, pretty good. But there is one very, very important thing that goes into all stories. Do you have any ideas what it could be? Hmm. This is a little bit tricky. Imagination. The ideas and imagination. So I want to add imagination from everybody to add to our soup. And so imagination is not really something you can see. We'll just pretend to pull a little imagination out of your head. And since you're sitting out there, you can blow it up to me and I'll try and catch it. Okay? Everybody, pull out some imagination. Blow it up to me. Okay, I caught it. All right, from everybody. All right, I'm gonna stir it up, all of our imag imagination together, and pour it in the soup. So let's sing. Now we add imagination. Now we add imagination. Now we add imagination. Stir slow around we go. We're making story soup. Oh my goodness. This soup seems like it is just fabulous. I wonder if it's done. How about if we sing the song one more time and I'll see if it has cooked up our first story for today. Here we go. We're making story soup. We're making story soup. Stir slow. Around we go. Oh my goodness. We're making story soup. You're not going to believe this. How did you get in there? Are you ready? Oh. Look who I found in our soup. Oh, it's Pete the cat. Do you think we are going to be doing a story about Pete the Cat for our very first one? I think you are right. This is Pete the Cat. I Love My White Shoes by Eric Litwin with art by James Dean. And then we'll have to stir the soup some more and see what our next story will be. Good job, everyone.